Good morning, it's Saturday, January 2nd, and this is the Wenatchee World's newest podcast, Slices of Wenatchee. We're excited to bring you a closer look at one of our top stories and other announcements every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Today, Wenatchee's Connor Faulkner on breaking into the L.A. rap scene. Today's episode is brought to you by Equilus Group Incorporated. Equilus Group Incorporated is a registered investment advisory firm in the states of Washington, Oregon, and Idaho. Equilus Group Incorporated, building your financial success. Learn more at equilusfinancial.com, member SIPC and FINRA. Now our feature story. It's been hard to even take a step, and even harder just to take a breath. And every moment that I thought we spent, I saw it going... For 25-year-old Connor Faulkner, his hometown is Wenatchee, but he moved to L.A. to follow his career goals. Now he's known professionally as Dive. The first step on his continuing journey to fame? Sleeping in a car for three months. Faulkner said that the biggest challenge for artists is the uncertainty. There were some nights during his tour when he was really cold and would wear three hoodies, but the experience helped him to build a fan base and learn how to sell his music. His most recent success came after he released the single That's My B in July. He has amassed over 700,000 Spotify streams since its release. Part of the song's popularity is due to Dwayne The Rock Johnson sharing Faulkner's new jam on his Instagram, which has 205 million followers. Right now, there are roughly 25,000 people who now have a dive song on their playlists. The Rock is one of them. For Faulkner, breaking into the LA music scene is difficult, but very guiding. There are so many people there creating music, and every new artist is an opportunity to learn or collaborate with. He says that the difference between LA and North Central Washington is the amount of people, and how much is going on. Every other person in LA is in the music industry, or so it seems, and there are shows on a nightly basis. But Faulkner does still appreciate his hometown roots, and thinks Wenatchee is one of the best places in the world. From a young age, he has always loved music, and participated in various musicals while growing up in Wenatchee. It took a good four or five years of learning how to sing in choir until mom stopped cringing at the missed notes. As a college graduation present, Faulkner's parents bought him a laptop with Logic Pro music software for producing songs. That's when he started learning how to mix, master, record, and do everything. One of Faulkner's most life-changing moments as a developing artist was in 2017, after he finished a show in Walla Walla and saw for the first time that he had followers. A pair of 11-year-olds came up and said how they were the biggest fans of his music. You can find Faulkner's music on various streaming sites, including Spotify, Apple Music, Amazon, and Google Play. And make sure to stick around to hear his song Another Step at the end of our episode. Now, our weekly profile of one of the world's 30 Under 35 award recipients. Today, we're highlighting John Wozneski, an energy analyst at the Chelan County PUD. Wozneski has been an energy analyst for Chelan County PUD since the summer of 2017. His co-workers describe him as conscientious, working diligently to find a need and fill it, no matter whether it's small, large, or highly technical. And, according to reports, he does it with a smile on his face. Wozneski graduated from the United States Military Academy at West Point in 2011, and received the General Donald R. Keith Memorial Award as the top graduate. While at West Point, he also played Division I football. After graduation, he served as an officer for more than five years, which included duty stations all over the world. He switched to the private sector in 2016, moving to Wenatchee, where his wife was born and raised. He is currently working on his master's degree in business administration with a concentration in finance from Washington State University. His anticipated graduation is next fall. He and his wife Stephanie welcomed their first child in July. Wozneski says that he's always held himself to a high standard, and as he's had success, that standard has only become higher. Finally, some local history. Wenatchee Valley History is brought to you by Neighbor, your trusted neighborhood community. Neighbor is a free online forum you can trust to connect with your community, focus on facts, and make a difference. Join the conversation. Visit WenatcheeWorld.com slash N-A-B-U-R. With the railroad came an alarming increase in drunkenness, disorderly behavior, and crime. A shack town developed beside the Columbia River, and in 1908, Mayor John Galatly even issued an ineffective order that all prostitutes leave the city or reform. Thanks for listening. We'd also like to thank our sponsor again, Equilus Group Incorporated, a registered investment advisory firm in the states of Washington, Oregon, and Idaho. 
The Wenatchee world has been engaging, informing, and inspiring North Central Washington communities since 1905. We encourage you to subscribe today to keep your heart and mind connected to what matters most in North Central Washington. Thank you for starting your morning with us, and don't forget to tune in again on Tuesday. Now, as promised, dive. I don't want to take another step now. Such a long way down. Right. It's been hard to even take a step and even harder just to take a breath. And every moment that I thought we spent, I saw it going somewhere different than you saw, I guess. It's like, I've been trying almost every day to be the one to call you out on your bad days. To be the one that you call up when you get afraid. So I can sprinkle comfort on you like I'm Salt Bay. Yeah. And we just been through way too much. We trying to reinvent the wheel like we eat long much. And I feel like the dawn is never hitting the dusk. And I feel like my hope is missing out on the trust. So, I don't know if we'll be fine, baby. It's hard to turn around when you want to hide. Every mile getting further from the line I don't know, will this fire keep burning or die? I don't want to take another step now It's such a long way down I need a little space to catch my breath now Before I let you down I just keep stalling out no, I don't want to turn back Probably don't deserve you, but I know that I could earn that We could have a new flame, baby, we could burn that We could have a new love, maybe we could learn